हेलो माय डियर फैमिली मेंबर्स आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग वेल फॉर योर अपकमिंग एसेंशियल एग्जाम टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू कवर सम इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चंस फ्रॉम प्रीवियस लॉट दैट वाज हेल्ड ऑन लाइक 9th ऑफ नवंबर ओके सो गाइस एक्चुअली आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर सम क्लाउड बेस्ड क्वेश्चंस एट फर्स्ट देन आई विल शो सम एब्स्ट्रैक्ट रीजनिंग क्वेश्चंस ओके so basically whatever questions i am going to share with you right now those are almost repeated okay let's say you are asked one questions okay so let me share some important experience which will be very much helpful for you in your upcoming slots okay let's say you are asked what is the what is the use of antivirus okay antivirus this is the question okay and in option you are having one like in first option there will be some uh, written functions in second option there will be some functions and third option there will be some function in fourth also there will be some functions okay basically let's say the option one is correct answer okay it is fine that option one is a uh, right answer but whatever options given in the option 2 option 3 option 4 these three also are very much important for you because the let's say in your exam in your slot they will ask the questions like just changing few functionalities changing few terminologies and with these options okay so these uh, like those options which are not correct those will be important for your upcoming slots as well okay so i hope you understood what i am trying to make you understood okay so let me share some questions uh, so that you can get it right now okay so uh, before that if you have not subscribed it then please just click on this button it doesn't cost anything just little bit your effort and so your big heart okay just click on it okay i will be motivated to make more content for you guys okay so let me share the first question that is regarding osi model okay so guys which of the following layer of the osi model is used to translate encrypt and compress data application presentation session transport network data link physical layer so like don't see the options which is being checked or being clicked already so just ignore that and try to give the answer in the comment section okay okay so i hope you have tried so let me just explain this so i hope you guys know what's the function what's the responsibilities of each layer in osi model so let me just share that okay uh actually i have clicked that yeah so at first physical layer so physical layer is useful to send the data from the physical devices to physical wire okay so physical uh, layer is responsible for sending the data from physical devices to the physical wire okay and the data which is sent from this a physical device is cached by this layer data link layer it reads the mac address from the data packet which is uh, like accepted from this layer okay then the network layer comes and it uh, like divides it make uh, the data and it divides the data into multiple segment then it transport that data to the next layer and also it reassemble those data okay so transport layer is responsible for sending the segmented data and again uh, reassemble the segmented data okay then the session layer comes sorry uh then the session layer comes okay and it is responsible for establishing or ends the connection between two host okay so between two host it just connect the uh, connection okay it establish the connection and presentation layer it is useful for encryption and decryption of the data okay and any if there any data is segmented or let's say not in proper format format okay it is useful this presentation layer is useful to make it presentable 
to make it more formatted okay and application layer is useful services uh, is good for services that uh, are used with end user applications okay so i hope you understood so let me just check the answer so here which options is appropriate according to you okay so option six i like option b will be the correct answer that is presentation layer is useful for encryption and decryption okay compressing the data okay so let's say this is the question so at the at the very beginning of the video what i was trying to let you know that is let's say in this case they have asked this question that is in osi model translate encryption and compress uh, which layer does it okay so the question can be different for you that is they will give the function of transport layer and i am not like giving you false information it was happened the, in the last slot that is they asked that uh, which layer which layer is useful for segmenting the data and reassembling the data so that is transport layer so for that case transport layer was the answer but in your slot it may happen that what is the use of network layer okay like what is the use of network layer and they will give you the function of network layer and they may ask which layer is useful for that okay so i hope you understood so let me go to the next question so the next question is this the host id in class a ip address is how many bits long so before uh, like before i give the answer let me show the sorry yeah so as you can see yeah so as you can see uh in class a in class a total 8 bits are reserved for network id and total 24 bits are reserved for host id and in class b so as i have told this time they have asked for class a but for you they may ask for class b and like in the last slot in any of the last slot they have asked this same questions from class c okay and i have also uploaded in in this video regarding that same question okay so this time they have asked from class a so 8 bits for network id and 24 bits for host id class b network id a 16 bits and 16 bits for host id and class c network id 24 bits and host id 8 bits okay 8 bits and uh, class d is uh, like useful for multicast address and class e is reserved ip address okay so like using the question i am giving you one question more that is like give me the range of class c give me the range of class d this is a quick question for you guys so please give the answer in the comment section and this question was also asked and i am giving you to check your knowledge if you know or not okay i hope you know please give the answer to motivate me okay so let me share the next question so let me just uh, click on the right answer that is class b sorry uh, option b that is 24 host id for class a that is 24 okay so the next question is regarding yeah stream cipher works on transposition technique or substitution technique please give the answer in the comment section uh, before I give you the answer, let me introduce our prime materials in which we have included all the recent questions with answers, all the previous year questions with answers, like all co cognitive questions, all coding questions, all technical part are there, including all mock tests. So if you want all of these and if you have a very lower preparation, then please have it and cover all these and just crack the Accenture. Questions are getting repeated, so you can consider it so that you can get the repeated questions okay so 79 rupees you have to spend only just use the EPA id given in the description box and send me the screenshot of the same to our insta handle instagram.com slash techno.tf okay i'll give it at, at your mail okay so let me answer that so for this question guys stream cipher works on transposition text techniques substitution techniques 
so which option is correct okay so guys actually uh this cipher actually is uh, related to data encryption okay data encryption and this encryption is having two techniques mainly that is transposition transposition and substitution okay so in substitution what happens the data let's say if you have written a b c d okay this will be encrypted like all the letters all the characters will be replaced with number with the number or any other character any other character or any symbol okay any symbol so in substitution technique all the letters all the characters are substituted or replaced with number character any other character or any symbols okay this is the technique uh, used for encryption in uh, stream cipher okay so basically this is stream cipher and this is related to substitution technique so option 2 will be the correct answer okay so let me go to the next question so the next, next question is this in cloud architecture backend refers to which of the following web browser data storage or virtual machine so basically uh, as you know guys presentation layer or let's say uh, the web browser in which we are directly interact that is front end okay and in back end there are some datas which are stored in storage okay which are stored in storage there should be virtual machines you can use okay so these are all back end data okay so let me share uh, the same as you can see in cloud architecture uh, the client infrastructure will be the front end and the storage and virtual machines all will be uh, aligning in the back end okay so in this case the correct answer will be option a that is data storage and virtual machines so these are all aligning inside back end okay so let me go to the next question guys if you like uh, having any issue any problem then let me know in the comment section i will try to assist you okay and guys if you have not subscribed it yet then please subscribe it and watch the playlist regarding any company that you want so that it will be better for yourself only okay so guys in this case what will be the correct answer service level agreement defines level of service availability performance guarantees by the csp okay let me share one thing that is what is service level agreement actually this agreement is done between uh, the client okay the client and the developers okay developers so like developer must assure the client that our level of service will be very good our availability uh, and at which time will be available at which time will not be available what will be the our occasional holidays so these are all they have to like mention to their client in the service level agreement also they have to assure their performance guarantee okay so these are basically uh, like in short form this is sla and like these are done between client and the developer so all of these they need to assure and they must be in service level agreement so option d will be the correct answer okay so let me go to the next question so the next question is regarding yeah abstract reasoning so p o p e q o q f is to is to next is to what so guys please give the answer in the comment section before i give okay so as you can see what uh, like formula they are for what pattern they are following so p q so plus one o o no increment no decrement p q plus one e f plus one okay so that for next what it should follow that is n plus one that is o okay e 
here as you can see no increment no decrement so e must be there okay and x plus 1 that is y okay and t that is also plus 1 that should be u okay so according to the first pattern it should be o e y u okay but in option this is not there so for that case you have to choose this one o f y u i think they have mistakenly printed o instead of p so it's okay but whichever is the almost right answer you should follow that okay o f y u will be the correct answer okay so let me go to the next question so the next question will be a quiz question for you guys and this will be the last question for this session find the missing term in the series given below so t tax x w s and the question mark then f o y which one will be the correct answer okay i hope you guys are getting uh, familiar with the questions and you are liking the session so guys if you liked it then please subscribe the channel and watch the playlist regarding any company that you want and if you want any other questions any let's say if you want more coding questions only if you want more any other companies questions then please recommend me that particular things in comment section so that it will be not it will be notified by me okay so guys your recommendation actually i give importance to that so please recommend i will try to make content on that okay and if you want any question solution then please send the question to our insta handle i will try to make a videos on that questions answer only okay so guys i hope this much of discussion is enough for today's session so thank you for today's session